For more videos visit forthesakeofeducation.com Alright guys, well, let's do this problem where they want you to find the magnitude of the projected component of this force along the, pi the pipe AO. So they want you to find this component of the force. So basically the first thing you need to do is find the Cartesian vector form of the force and then find the Cartesian vector form of the unit vector from A to O. So the way to start these problems is to find the position of all the points involved. A sits at 0i plus 4j plus 6k. B sits at 4i plus 5j plus 0k. And O sits at the origin, which is 0, 0, 0. Now that you have all the points involved, let's start finding some vectors. So the vector that goes from A to B is equal to vector B minus vector A and it's equal to 4i plus 1j minus 6k. The magnitude of this vector can be found by doing the x component square plus the y component square plus the c component square and it comes out to be 7.28 now what you need to do is find the uni vector AB which is this tiny vector right here with a magnitude of 1 and you do so by dividing vector AB by its own magnitude now you're gonna get that this uni vector is equal to 0.549i plus 0.137j minus 0.824k if you wanted to find the Cartesian vector form of the force which is what we need to do you know that its magnitude is 400 so the Cartesian vector form is given by multiplying its magnitude by the unit vector going along the force which is unit vector a b which is equal to 400 times these three values and it comes out to be 220i plus 55j minus 330k now we need to find the uni vector going along AO which is this tiny vector right here to do that we need to find first vector AO which is vector O minus vector A but since O is the origin, it's the same as the opposite of vector A, which is 0i minus 4j minus 6k. The magnitude of AO is found with this same formula, x squared plus y squared plus c squared all square rooted, and it comes out to be 7.21. The uni vector AO is found by dividing AO by its magnitude. So dividing these three values by 7.21 gives you the uni vector which comes out to be 0 in the i minus 0.555 in the j minus 0.832 in the k. Now that you have the uni vector, to find the projected component of the force along AO, all you need to do is to the dot product of the force dot the uni vector AO. And this is the same as the force is 220i plus 55j minus 330k 0i minus 0.555j minus 0.832k. So 220 times 0 is 0. 55 times 0 0.555 is negative 30.5 and negative 330 times negative 0 0.832 is positive 274.5 so this comes out to be 244 244 is the magnitude that's what they want they want the magnitude of the vector going along AO which is the component of the force F. 
final answer. Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.